Hello, I'm from the Church of Black Coffee, and today I'm just going to introduce philosophy. So philosophy is not what you think it is. Often you might have heard somebody say something like, my philosophy is you should uh, just live and let live. That's not really philosophy. Philosophy is the pursuit of the true nature of stuff. So it used to be the case that philosophy was really concerned, for example, with uh, stars. Philosophers gathered and discussed what it could be that stars are made out of, where they came from, uh, where they go during the day, all that kind of stuff. And then they figured it out. And so it stopped being philosophy and it started being science. So that was uh, pretty common as far as philosophical pursuits go. Once they develop concrete answers, they move into a different academic discipline, uh, namely generally sciences. So philosophy is left with those things for which science does not have uh, ready answers. So, there are three branches of philosophy, essentially. I mean, there's, there's more, but there's three primary branches of uh, philosophy. There is epistemology. Epistemology is the study of knowledge. So what is knowledge? That's actually really interesting. Uh, people certainly have a lot of beliefs, uh, people think things, but what do people know? And what does it take to know something? Uh, so we're going to look at a few different scenarios in the future uh, about uh, that kind of elucidate the possibility that you don't know anything. Which might not be a surprise to some of you. Another branch is ethics. So ethics is the study of morality. What is it that's right or wrong? What is the correct action to take uh, in a given situation? So what is right and wrong? And again, we're going to find uh, that the answers are not forthcoming a lot of the time. Uh, it might seem obvious that certain things are right, certain things are wrong, but those beliefs quickly break down. Easy example, your family is starving to death. Uh, you live in a kingdom in which the king has made a loaf of bread cost many thousands of dollars, way beyond the, uh, the affordability of anybody. You see an open bread truck. Should you steal the bread to feed your family? Yeah. Stealing is okay in that situation. So if stealing can be okay in a particular situation, you can imagine there's lots of scenarios in which murder is also okay and various other things are okay. So the idea of there being a concrete right or wrong is a question in itself. Ethics is the study of if there is a concrete right or wrong, how do we figure out what that is? Finally, we have metaphysics. This is another word that people use incorrectly all the time. Metaphysics is not the study of ghosts. It is not the study of just auras or positive energy, bro, or whatever, any of that crap. Metaphysics is the study of what is. What is an object? What, uh, what constitutes one thing versus the other? You are composed of a trillion atoms, many trillions of atoms. What is it about the combination of those atoms that makes you a distinct object? How come you are not just a trillion atoms in a pile or whatever? Uh, so, these are the three branches of Epistemology talks about what it is to know something. Ethics talks about uh, what is right, what is wrong, how do we figure it out. And metaphysics is the study of, of what, how do you constitute an object? What is an object? How can many things come together to form one thing? Um, another way to think about metaphysics is like your arm is a part of you, but what if you cut your arm off? Is it still a part of you? How much of yourself could you cut off before you stop being you anymore? It's the kind of stuff that keeps you up at night. Uh, so, we are going to go through all this stuff. Um, by the time I'm done with you, you are going to be just as confused as I am about all of this. At least if I'm doing my job right. Okay? Alright.